warmer. Little Rube's a star. So much for coaching. Bill, for Saturday's goal setting session, make free my last point. Okay? Hi, my name is Kirsten, and this is my running channel. I run because it's just good to go out in the open air and run. And I run because when I have a bad day, I can just go and run and leave all my guts on the road. And then when I come back, I can smile. And I, if you want to know how I started running, one day I brought a um, permission slip form from cross country, and I gave it to my dad. And then I ran the race, and I got fourth place. And then. I went to London and I got 83rd. It, it made me run harder. I ran faster. Not till I got to this point and got third in Guelph. But this is my medal I got in Guelph. And uh, I got third place. And um, when I get older, my dream is to run in the University of Oregon. Sir Prefontaine is this guy who um, used to be the greatest distance runner in America. He never gave up. and. Um, he died in a car accident, and um, that was really sad. He was the greatest American distance runner. Prefontaine motivates me because of how he was competitive in his races and how he worked so hard at it, and he never gave up. And I'm also going to be running a race in Florida. There's going to be a cruise. I'm going to be able to train on the track and the cruise, and there's going to be a track on the cruise, and I'm going to have lots of fun. And you guys will probably see a video of me running there. I got these for Christmas. So it says dream. And believe. I want to show you a few of my shoes. They're Nike brand. And they have, this one has spikes. They're used so when the gravel road. So then when it, there's mud and rain, you don't slip. And then this one used to have spikes. And it's orange and yellow like Oregon colors and um, enjoy watching my core training video that I do tonight and then watch my two and a half kilometer run tomorrow. Free turn distance running into a blood sport. You want to know what he meant to folks around here? What was it the kids used to say back then? You just had to be there.